With today's technology young people have lost the art of true filmmaking that has served countless filmmakers of the 40s to the 80s. The high-tech 50 to $100,000 cameras that are used in mega-million dollar films are actually not necessary if you know the secrets of past film techniques. What you actually need First and foremost is a good story. Maybe you have that idea but have no way to bring that to market. Next, you need friends that can act and crew that want to make a film with you. Now comes the big secret, using the right equipment to have your film have the professional look that will get it into theaters and or Netflix. Here's what you need for your micro or zero budget. Sony Cybershot 4K Pocket Camera it cost $500 to $900, I have seen that much of a spread. That may be a lot but remember you must have 4K to sell your project to the masses. Second, you will need a small Sony digital stereo recorder for your dialogue with clear, crisp audio that the audio mic of the camera will not produce. These two items are not connected so the picture from the camera and audio recorder must be synced together and will need a clapperboard. Google it. The small digital recorder can be worn by one of the actors or hidden on the cafe table or on the set. Although the Cybershot can record amazing pictures in very low light, be a pro and have some proper lighting. You will need some small battery-powered LED lights, some various colored gels, some scrims and some stands to mount these items on in the set. Now the biggest telltale look of unprofessional work is hand-holding the camera and with this tiny camera any movement will look terrible. With a camera this small you don't need an expensive tripod. A simple light stand with a quarter inch threaded screw on top will mount the camera. A cheap tripod for a still camera will work even better. The next telltale sign of amateurs is no lighting. In a moment I will tell you about a good textbook to help you with that. That covers the equipment needs and now you need some training in the art of professional filmmaking. There are very few books on the subject by true Hollywood filmmakers. There is one that covers all the basics at a fair price called Advanced Film and Video Production, used in colleges as a complete course and is available on Amazon and B. Dalton booksellers. Check it out, learn some basic skills, and get started making your first truly professional feature film. What drawbacks should you consider with this approach? One thing for certain, you will not be able to move this tiny camera because it does not have the mass to move smoothly. In the old days the cameras were huge so there was not much camera movement and yet the audience never seemed to notice. They solved it by moving the actors in the frame. Toward the camera or in and out of focus. There is much to learn before pursuing this endeavor but it is possible to use equipment this simple to achieve making your first film. Remember, it is called the art of filmmaking for a reason. In film production, the cameras can hold only 10 minutes of film. Epic films like Ben-Hur were shot with only 10 minutes per load. In this case, you will have only 5 minutes due to media storage ability. Plan your production wisely and you will do well. There are free editing software systems online and there is free music sources that will give your production the quality look and sound that will give you the chance you have been waiting for to be the next George Lucas or Catherine Bigelow. It starts with a great premise and a story that engages your audience. Without a good story all the expensive equipment and name actors and special effects will not make you any more successful. On the other hand, if you have a great idea, even equipment this simple can make you successful.